Sean Elaine with the ABC News. I'm here at the Kennedy Center in Florida where just this morning at 9.30 a.m. we sent the first Barbie into outer space. About three years ago, Intel created their first space shuttle, which they ironically named Ken. Now, we had never sent a toy into space before, but using our engineering and science, we were able to do it for the first time today. It was virtually a flawless launch this morning, and as Ken carried Barbie into space, he also carried her into history. She was grinning with excitement even before the launch. The fans chanted, Ride, Barbie, ride, as they stood below. Thousands gathered to watch this historical event. Barbie compared her journey into space like being opened on Christmas morning. It was a smooth and comfortable ride, she said. Barbie's owner, a five-year-old little girl named Sally, watched below with tears in her eyes, proud of the little girl she has raised since she opened her in the box that first fateful day. Later, Barbie beamed down pictures of the earth below, and she grinned as she went about her duties in the shuttle. Barbie's mission is the deployment of the U.S. communications satellite. But for many, by taking Barbie into space, the shuttle completed its most impressive mission when it left the pad this morning. I'm Elaine Williams for ABC News, the Kennedy Space Center in Florida.